Hey, Jing Peeps. I know Mike's a big fan of my headshots. He's going to love this one. In this segment, we'll be talking about how to use Jing Pro to create HD quality screencasts on YouTube. The first thing you want to do is use Jing to create some video in the proper aspect ratio and size to take advantage of YouTube's HD quality. So we'll go up to Jing. We'll choose Capture and we'll get our familiar crosshairs. Now keep in mind you want to click and drag a region and you want to hold down the shift key to lock into a 16 by 9 aspect ratio. The next thing that's important is to get a 720p video. What that means is you want something that's 1280 by 720p. Luckily that's a 16 by 9 aspect ratio and we can easily snap to it with Jing. So there I've snapped to 1280 by 720. I've centered the content over what I want to capture. And now I'll go ahead and choose the video button and we'll begin recording. I'm going to launch a web page. Open up a new tab here in Safari 4. See the nice new tiled layout that you get thumbnail view. And we'll come into here get some news articles and that's going to be good enough for me. We'll go ahead and finish the recording by pushing the stop button and I'm going to close minimize my browser for now. We've got a nice preview. I'll give it a name and I'm going to go ahead and choose the YouTube button. So the video is now uploading to YouTube. Now, unfortunately, when you've recorded a video with Jing, you don't get a URL back from YouTube right away. YouTube actually has to process the video, and that takes a little bit of time. So, you notice when we click on that link, it says the video is not yet processed. So, we'll begin waiting. I'm going to go ahead and refresh my video. You can see the video is now available on YouTube. It's been processed. That was a fairly short video, and there wasn't a lot of demand on YouTube's server, so it went pretty quick. I'm going to click the HD button here. You notice it'll resize the page and I get this really beautiful, pristine video, HD quality video up on YouTube. If I pop into full screen, you can see, despite the fact that the video is scaled, the quality is still really high. This is definitely something that can uh, easily deliver quality videos to your audience. So no more cruddy, blurry, can't really see what's going on screen videos on YouTube. I pop out of full screen mode here. The other thing you can do is so you want to pass this URL onto someone and you want to ensure that it's viewed in HD mode, what you can do is add an ampersand, add HD equals 1, we'll just refresh that page. If I were to pass that link in an email or IM chat window, they would see this already in HD mode. They wouldn't have to actually directly click the uh, HD button down here to get the HD quality. That's all there is to it. Getting HD quality videos from Jing to YouTube is simple. And Mike, if you're willing to put some curlers in your hair, you can look this damn good too as well. See you, Jane Groups.